everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 42, and this is war number seven. And we're going up against an alliance called Brotherhood Antona Ragnareki. All righty, let's see, who have they banned? Oh, wow. Magneto, Ghost, and Infamous Iron Man. Okay, we're going to see who they got planned. I got a bad feeling. I got a feeling. All right. Let's uh, spectate, see what we got planned here. All right. Okay, so I take path three. So we got Super Skrull, Guardian, and Sasquatch. Okay. Ooh. That's why they got rid of Magneto. That future Ant-Man is going to be a nightmare without... Oh, boy. Ooh. Okay. Oh, and we've got Omega Sentinel. Nimrod. What is up with all the tech? And we got Thing. Okay. So, interesting, interesting. I'm going to think about this one. But anyway, um, I'm thinking of bringing in Nebula for that Omega Sentinel and that Nimrod. And then it really depends on... He gets... Armor, he gets armor, so that's Gallon. So Gallon, Nebula, and then depends on what. Um, yeah, depends on who I bring, who, what mini I'm going to take. I'm trying to think here at the same time as looking over here. Uh, Hulkling does really good against him, but on this node, I don't know. Especially these armor ups and that buffet. See, it's nullified, and I don't believe uh, Hulkling is immune to nullify. He's immune to uh, burn, power burn. Um, but yeah, the only one that I know. Hmm. I mean. Could also go in with somebody without a buff. That works too. Hmm. That's gonna be a pain. Um, trying to think of who I'll have to talk it over, but yeah, Titania. Um hey, Ant Man. <laughs> uh Spider-Man 2099, Red Guardian. All of them would do well, but future Ant Man is an annoying defender anyway with all of that glancing and the armor ups that he gets insane so we'll see but gallon for sure and nebula for sure and then somebody for one of the minis all right we'll be back with the fighting all right so i'm going in with gallon nebula and falcon I don't think you guys have seen me bring Falcon to war. And this particular Falcon is only a rank three. And he's not even awakened. But, spoiler alert, he doesn't need to be awakened. All right, so we're going to start with Super Scroll. Now, Super Scroll does get armor ups. So you know what that means. On this particular path, he's gallon food. Uh, now, he is still annoying to fight. You still have to watch for the um, falter. But as you'll see, gallon is uh, more than up for the task. In fact, I don't believe he ever gets to falter. All right, so you see here, now he's got his armor up. So now I'm just doing regular combos. And look at, look at the planetary mass. Look at that. Crazy. I'm not even at a bar power yet. 
Now I just got to parry. Heavy. Right into a special. And the fight's done. No need to worry about falter. Nothing. Just done. That's what it looks like when Gallon eats. Man, I love this Gallon, boy. He is a beast. All right, next fight, we've got Guardian. Now, Guardian can be annoying because of the auto block, and he also has his armor up, right? And on this path, that would be a good option if you don't have Gallon. So, as you'll see again, he's got his armor up, and look at this. Look at that planetary mass just building up. He fires his special. Looks a lot like the last fight. Now I just need to get him with a heavy. Parry didn't work there. Alrighty. Here we go. Parry. Heavy. Into a special. And it don't matter if he tries to auto block that. It won't work. So Gallon ate yet again. Yummy. All right. I love, I love Gallon, man. And when they put Gallon food on my path, I absolutely love it. All right. I don't believe I, I messed with... Yeah, I didn't uh, mess with this Sasquatch. I'm trying to remember if this is the war. I believe this war... Um, I know I took one of the minis. I can't remember if I took two. Um, they might have been waiting for me there. Let me see. Who is that one? Nope. Okay, so I just took the uh, last mini. All right, so we've got Omega Sentinel, who you see on this uh, node uh, a lot these days, you know? And, of course, I'm going to go in with Nebula. Nebula is not a champion that people uh, often um, ban. And she's bleed immune. So she's perfect for this. And she'll shut down Omega Sentinel. Did I say Omega Red? Can't remember. Uh, but Omega Sentinel. Okay. So you guys saw me fight her before, right? This is one of the sloppiest fights. Because I'm fighting the inputs here. Okay. And you're going to watch when this happens. So the plan right here is going well. We're just building up. Evading. Building up. You know, evading. That, that, that's all. All we're doing. Look at that. What just happened there? What happened? Okay. So now I'm worried. You see, I, I parried out of uh, panic. And I'm just like, okay. Okay, we need to calm down. You know, get, get this under control. Look at that. Parried again. This time into a special two. And I'm like, okay, this should be enough. This should be enough. 1%. Seriously? Seriously. 1%. Anyway, we got her down. It was not pretty, but we got her down. Okay? Oh, my goodness. See, when, when stuff happens with the input, it throws me off. And then I start playing panicky because now I can't trust my swipes and my taps. Now I'm nervous. You know? And I'm like, okay. All right, we got it, we got it. Wait, no, we got to get this back under control. You know, get back to the plan, back to the plan, you know. It's really, really, really annoying. All right, so we already know what Nebula can do to Nimrod. And on this particular node, it's not going to be any difficulty. You see, we're just doing what we normally do when we fight Nimrod. Um, I don't have to worry about the shock. So I'm just going to build up, build up. Build up. There we go. One more build up. There we are. Now, all I need to do is get to a special two. I won't get power locked because she's already shut him down. Okay, so all I need at this point is to get to two bars. There we go. Now a parry. Bam. Special two. And watch him go tick. Boom. Lovely. Okay, so... We got another fight. And this fight, well, this is why I brought Falcon. 
And as you can see, we've got a rank four, probably a SIG 200 thing against this rank three unawakened Falcon. And let me tell you something. I, I considered awakening him with a generic gem because I'm sick of seeing him not awaken. All right. But he doesn't really need it. And I think I have like four generics right now. But again, he don't really need it. So I got the locked on. And as you can see, I'm doing some good damage anyway. And that was through his um, protection. Look at this. Okay. He turtled up a little bit. Got protection on again. So now I'm just backing off a little bit. Just waiting for my um, locked on to come off cooldown. Now I'm trying to get it back. There we go. It's back locked on. And I'm going back in. And just look at this. Look at this. Fire the special. Two, one. Look at that. Look at that. Lovely. 17% already. And see, he's turtling up. He don't want to. He don't want to fire that off. He's waiting for that um, locked on. And as soon as locked on was about to end, that's when he fired his special. Okay. And so I'm just like, you know what? Let's just go. I know how to fight thing. Boom. And he's done. Lovely. Falcon is crazy. Okay. He is crazy. All right. Now. I believe I had another fight. Let's see. Think, yeah. This infamous uh, Iron Man, or I do. Uh, I was told uh, Gallon was good for this fight. Now, you guys got to see this. I, this is the first time I'm fighting uh, infamous Iron Man on this node, right? So you see, I. I, I Put on a nice little invulnerability boost because I don't know what to expect. I want you to look at that recovery. See that recovery? Yeah, you're going to see it. All right. So, I know how to fight infamous Iron Man now, right? So, here we go. We've got uh, the armor up, but it's not really doing nothing, right? And we have safeguard. But, Gallon's damage, his harvest, bypasses safeguard, okay? So, as you can see here, I'm just building up, building up, okay? Medium light mediums, okay? And you're going to see this. This this was wild, okay? Medium light mediums, okay? Whoop. Nice, nice. Bam! Got lucky there, okay? Because he still had his uh, armor thingy up. All right, so now I'm just getting as many as I can in there. Yeah, his aura, uh, that iron or whatever. Okay, so now I'm going to hit him with a special three. And then the harvest is going to trigger. So the special three is not going to do that much damage. But the harvest, that's where we get the big boy damage, right? But I didn't build up enough. It's, it's a lot, but it's not enough. Okay, so watch when that harvest ends. Watch his health. Okay, look at this. We got 700. Okay. Doing good. Watch this. Boom. Almost. Now look at his health. Look at the healing. Look at the healing, y'all. Ain't that sad? I looked at that and I'm like, are you kidding me? Did he just heal all the way back up to full? And of course, while he's healing, he's unblockable. So I just basically backed off, waited that out. I'm like, okay, he's going to get back to full. Just let him do it. Let him do it. And let's just reset and go back in again. Okay. You know, he won't survive this next. One. You know, now, now I know. Now I should have built all the way up and I might've been able to avoid that phase by just taking him out one shot, you know, but I didn't know. I wasn't maxed uh, planetary mass. Okay, now, see, I, I did it again. I wasn't at full planetary mass, but I'm getting nervous with all of the little incidental damage I'm taking, and my health is down to 31%. See, so I'm, I'm a little nervous at this point, and you saw that I got hit, 
So I'm like, okay, you know, let's calm down. Let's, let's relax. There we go. We got, you know, much more this time. Okay, we're going to let that the harvest completed. Still didn't take him out. But this time he's not going to heal. Okay, so now I'm just doing medium like medium again. Look at that. Got hit again. But thankfully, we had the indestructible. Okay, so here we go. I'm just trying to wait this out. You see, that time I did not hit him with a heavy because he still had that uh, aura up or whatever. Okay, now I hit him with a heavy right into a special two. And he's done. So it bypassed the safeguard. Not the best of fights, but it was my first time doing that particular fight. All right, so that's it for my participation in this particular war. We'll be back and you'll see how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. It was a close war, as you can see. Let's take a look here. Look at that. Look at that. Very, very close, guys. Look at this. Very close. Great war. All right, so that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.